This is 500 South 9th Street in Clinton, Missouri. Very nice ranch style home. Has a double garage here in this left end. And then there's another uh, detached double garage and a storage building. A nice fenced backyard. Really nice neighborhood. I'll swing around and give you a little bit of shot of the surrounding homes. Okay. They had this tree stump left when they removed the tree. It was old. And uh, they were going to put 500 in the uh, tree stump, cut it in there so people could find it real easy here on the corner. And it is a corner lot. Here's the double garage that is attached. And there's a sidewalk on the outside from the double garage going out around to this deck right here and then the double garage has a separate driveway here and it's a two-car garage also and this room you see right here is a sunroom real nice has a half bath off of that has uh, newer central air and heat and appliances, I think they're about a year and a half old. And they were going to stay with the property. It's a nice, good sized garage. This is detached. And there's another building behind this inside the fenced in yard. And this is the fenced in backyard. This is the detached building there besides the double garage. This is right behind it and it is a concrete floor in it and in front of it and then blocks leading up to the uh, a door that goes into that sunroom there. And then here's a little patio beside the other building. So this is your entryway Real nice flooring. And the living room is around here to your left. And then there is a pass-through that goes into the dining area. Uh, they've installed uh, a lot of these LED lights. And really neat. This one in the living room actually has a remote control, as several of them do. And uh, it has a, you can punch a button and uh, a fan will come out and right from the top of that light. It's pretty neat. Nice size living room. This goes right straight on through into a hallway. To the right is your utility room, bedrooms, and bathroom. We'll go to the kitchen here first. This is the dining room right here. Uh, new vinyl throughout. He just installed that. This goes has a double door. Here it goes on out to the patio. The, all the appliances the owner says are only about one and a half years old. My wife would love this double oven, built-in oven. What a blessing for Thanksgivings and Christmas dinners and all that. Then this is your doorway into the double attached garage. Quite a nice countertop range. And we'll go back down the hall. So there's the utility room, and it has uh, a closet and the cabinets, storage cabinets. There's two over here, and then one right here behind me. There's four doors there, and then this closet. So there's a closet here, 
behind the door and that's the furnace and the water heater which are both newer um, year and a half I think they said this goes into the sunroom um, real nice very nice I have an extra AC unit over there and then this is another one of those fans you can see uh, lights and fans LED they throw out a lot of light it's real white light and there's there's other adjustments you can s adjust the light on them too but this is one that has a fan on it also then there's a half bath off of this and that walks through into the master bedroom so this is the half bath off the master bedroom between master bedroom and the sunroom has some real nice deep shelving to store linens and we go into the master bedroom beautiful floor vinyl plank flooring and it has a ceiling fan and lights and it has two closets they're both lighted have lights on them a pull chain as you can see there And this goes out into the hallway, and there's kind of a center, center area here, quite a bit of space, and there's a bedroom on the right and a bedroom on the left. Another one of those fancy lights and fans in this bedroom. And it has a fan in this one. Instead of the fan blades coming out from it, it has the fan blades in the center. I turn it off so you can see them. And a great big, nice closet. Must be eight foot long. There's your controls for that fan. Then the full bath is right here. It has a tub and a shower. They've done a really nice tile job on it. I like it all the way to the ceiling. There's your shower. And then I like this built-in area here for your cleaning products. Off of this hallway, uh, kind of a central area between the bedrooms and the bathroom, there are two large, deep closets. Those are probably two foot deep, they look like. And there's one over here. It's just as deep, only it has a smaller, shorter shelf in it. That's very nice. This is the third bedroom, and it has a couple windows also. It has a ceiling fan, but it's more of the older style, like I have. And then it has a closet, good sized closet on that too. Almost forgot to show you that there is an attic fan, and those are very handy for cooling the house down quickly and during the cusp of the year, the fall or the spring, just to have a nice breeze and not have to have the AC or the heater on. This is the two-car attached garage. Plenty of space. That's a sauna there, and they will take that with them. And there's a door to the patio and deck. And that door is, uh, has the screen with the magnet in the middle to the kitchen. And then there's a nice big built-in closet, well done, shelving all over on one side and then a shelf and a rod on the other side to hang in your clothes and stuff. So 500 9th Street in Clinton, Missouri. Looks like newer shingles also. A really, really nice one level home. Thank you for watching.